Tammy Sager! Um, I want to thank Jim for his country hospitality and um, making my argument for me, basically. Uh, felt like pretty much 90% of what you were saying was great about the country was really great about the city. Yes. Super funny, but great about the city. Um, I, I want to talk a little bit about safety, because we, we talked about cute dogs. Uh, as a woman, I feel like I would die. Uh, I have never been more scared than when I am in the country, and it's dark, or I'm out alone, or I've just gotten back from a walk. I need to check for ticks. But the rest of it is like horror movie scared. And horror movies take place in the country. I mean, it's cabin in the woods. It's not condo in the city. It's like... I'm not... Look, the city is more dangerous. You're definitely... We are surrounded by a lot more dangerous. But we are also five feet away from safety at any time. We are surrounded by other people. Yeah. That subway, it's inhumane. May, may I interject one thing? It's, you're less likely to get mugged in the country because you can hear the chainsaws in the distance. <laughs> and I'm, get a head running start. Great. Well, I'm going to say, like, look, I might also get killed in the city, but I will have witnesses. <laughs> if anything bad happens to you in the country, nobody will see it except for the stars. Oh! Oh, you get to see the stars in the country. Oh, wow. You know what we can do at night in the city? Anything. Wow. Like, if we want to see the night sky, like the real night sky, we can go to the planetarium. Because in the city, there's science. And we don't say we believe in science because science is not a faith based thing. It's literally empirical evidence. So even the phrase of like, you believe in science is like, oh, I believe you're an idiot. <laughs> now I say this as a city person and I realize that there's a lot of, people talk about country people being sweet. They also talk, you know, there's, you know anytime I think when people talk about something being sweet, it's a little bless your heart. <laughs> your heart being like the southern fuck you. I'd rather hear fuck you, right? Because then I can be like, yeah, fuck you. And then we're done. We're done with that interaction. We're not hearing stuff. Um, with, when you said that you were uh, stroking, stroking people the establishment, to me that's, no. This is the diplomacy that we practice on an everyday basis living on top of each other. We have to to, we are in such a delicate ecosystem of human lives that we are constantly making adjustments and allowments and it doesn't come out with a, with a please and a thank you always, but sometimes it does. But it always, we are constantly making room for each other and looking out for each other and stepping over each other. Sometimes we have a shoulder check so that people know. Or when you walk by, you go, you know, if you're gonna watch slow, walk there. Or, <laughs> I say we've already talked about like look we all live in the city but I also want to point out of course team country you're you're also in the city okay <laughs> I yield my time